All right, Coach, we're halfway through conference play. Only eight games left uh, in the season here, 17-4 and four overall and the 25th best win percentage in the nation. How did we get here? Um, just by focusing on one day at a time, to be honest, and, and being humble and coming in to work hard. And This team is great to coach because nobody cares who gets the credit. They're all just about winning, and that's the only thing that they really care about, um, that and each other. And going out and just every single day we're just trying to get better um, and not focus on what happened the day before, not look too far ahead. We're just kind of focused on the present, and I think – if you do that day after day after day, then good things happen. Two big wins this past weekend, sweeping Lipscomb and Central Arkansas. Laner was the player of the week, and Lexi had a fantastic weekend as well with over 40 assists in, in each game. I, just talk about the way the offense is just clicking right now. I think we're playing really well. You know, it helps that our service team has been really good this year. And then to have, I think, you know, I'm a little bit biased, but I think we have one of the best setters in the country and Lexi, who does a great job of spreading the ball around. And she, she kind of knows where to go in um, as far as matchups and kind of puts us in good opportunities to score. So I think a lot of it's her. And then um, a big part of it, too, is just all the versatile hitters that we have. It's hard for any team to focus on one player because somebody else can have a great night if they're focused on stopping just one player. So I think us being so balanced, having great, great serve receiving, having a great setter kind of all plays a part in that. Three games this weekend, Jacksonville on Friday, Liberty on Saturday, and then Sunday, the big showdown with Florida Gulf Coast. How do you just go in and stay focused and take it one game at a time this weekend? Um, I think it's just used to – from being used to doing that every single day in practice. Like, we haven't looked ahead yet, and we're not going to do it now. Um, you know, we Jack, we know Jacksonville presents a lot of challenges. Um, they've lost a lot of coach close matches. They got a, a good team, and, um, you know, Liberty is the same thing. Liberty's got a ton of talent. They're one of the most talented teams in this conference. So we're definitely not going to e overlook either one of those teams and kind of just focus on one day at a time. And then um, hopefully when Sunday comes around that we've already taken care of business on the days before. All right, Lena, so two big wins last weekend. Great offensive performance for the team and you individually. You were player of the week. Talk about the way this offense is just rolling over all this season. Um, honestly, it's just great to have a lot of versatile hitters. Like, we can put any of our hitters anywhere, and they're probably going to do great. Like, we have so much depth in so many different spots. It's just hard to stop any of us if we're all doing good. And how does it feel to be recognized as the player of the week? I mean, honestly, I don't really care about it that much. I just want, like, I just want us to win games. So that's really it. It's like nice to get it, but I'd rather just win games. I mean, it doesn't really mean that much. Three big games this weekend. What's the key to coming home with wins? Um, I'd say the key is to just focus on, like, going game by game and like focus on every point and not just like looking too much forward to, like, the next game, next day, whatever. Just focus on the game we're playing now.